Well, I know my son certainly has the biggest smile possible anytime he sees somebody else's pet, their dogs in particular. Great morning to take your dog out for a walk as we're pretty cool. You might need that light long sleeve. We've got quite a bit of cloud cover this morning. That's Camelback in the distance there. It's also going to be much cooler today across the state, including here in the valley. The winds are going to stick around and we've got a deep freeze coming to areas of our state. This low pressure system continuing to move into our state, bringing this rain that is continuing to fall at this hour across central and northern Arizona with snow across far northern Arizona. It'll continue to shift east. We'll continue to see snow as we move through the afternoon and evening hours and we'll see some rain later tonight across southern and southeastern Arizona. And then we start to clear out statewide before the next uh, storm system moves in, which will bring snow to the Four Corners area on Thursday once again. But otherwise, we'll stay dry all week here in the valley and with those clearer skies, our temperatures are going to plummet. In fact, we're looking at the first deep freeze of the year for areas like Flagstaff. Tonight, your temperatures are going to plummet into the 20s today. And when you wake up on Tuesday morning, in fact, for the next week, your morning lows are going to be in the 20s. And we're going to have colder temperatures in areas of southeastern Arizona overnight. So we do have a freeze watch in effect for areas surrounding Safford. So be mindful of that. Temperatures already down by 15 degrees in areas like the Grand Canyon and Page down by 10 degrees in Kingman and Sholo compared to this time yesterday. So temperatures have now dipped below freezing at the Grand Canyon this morning. We're at 41 degrees in Flagstaff, 47 in Prescott, 58 in Globe at 62 in Safford. Safford will make it into the 70s tonight before that deep freeze in the overnight hours. Sedona will warm to just 60 degrees today, staying in the 40s in Flagstaff and the 70s out to our west. So no more 90s for Lake Havasu City today. The winds are also staying consistent right now. Gusts are clocked at 38 miles in Flagstaff, 35 mile an hour gusts in Window Rock, close to that in Sholo. Those winds staying strong across northern and northwestern Arizona through the middle of the day. Even here in the valley, we'll have winds around 10 to 15 miles an hour, but those gusts could still reach 20 miles an hour. Going to take until late tonight for those winds to die down statewide. As for clouds and radar right now, here's the storm system that moved in overnight, still sitting over central. Arizona and we're still seeing just a stray shower in areas like Fountain Hills Globe. You might catch a little bit of rain pace and getting the bulk of it right now in Holbrook and snow still falling near the Grand Canyon Tuba City and along our northern border. Our temperatures here in the valley going to stay in the 60s until about 10 o'clock this morning. Then we're in the 70s and we stay in the 70s the rest of the day. We'll take those rain chances out by mid morning. It's just part of that storm system that we've got to keep that 10% in. Temps in the 70s for the next several days. In fact, taking to the middle of the week to warm back into the 80s and across the high country. Check those overnight lows in the 20s starting tonight. Pretty much below freezing every day for the next week.